Hello, little bears. I'm here again, but today I'm not going to talk about actual bears. I was thinking, we don't have bears here in Brazil, but that doesn't mean you don't have a beautiful fauna. So, who would be the Brazilian bear? I was thinking about the bear characteristics, and I decided that it's going to be the sloth. And let's talk to you about this. First, the sloth lives in the rainforest, and we have rainforests basically all around the world, and a lot of it here in Brazil. The rainforest is divided in two types. The temperate rainforest, as you can see, okay, a little bit colder, and also the tropical rainforest here at the south, and much, much, much hotter, okay? And as you can see, this, used to be the giant sloth. Tell me, doesn't it look like a little bear? Actually, a big, big bear? Those are extinct. They were giant, giant sloths from a long, long time ago. And newsflash, they used to eat avocados. So if you can eat avocados today, it's all because the extinct giant, giant sloth. But nowadays, just like bears, we don't have many, many species of sloths. Actually, we only have six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Only six species of sloths that are still alive today. Uh, and first, they're divided in two types, the three-toed sloth and the two-toed sloth, okay? And why is there a panda here? Sloths are so slow because they have a low metabolism. And do you know which one is the second animal with the slowest, me the slowest metabolism? The panda bear. So guys, they have more in common with bears than what we think. Let's talk about the sloth species, okay? First, the pygmy tree toad sloth. And let's look again. How are they in nature? This is one is quick to critically endangered. That means the population is decreasing very, very fast and soon it will be extinct in the wild. Oh, guy, we should fight this. We should take care of the sloths. That one we don't have here in Brazil. That one is only from a small island at Panama. Now let's see the other sloths. All the others we have here in Brazil. We have the manatee toad sloth. Look, Brazil and vulnerable again, guys. We should take care of our forests. The pale throated three toes sloth. Oh, look at how cute they are. And look at the three toes here. One, two, three. That one is also in Brazil, but that one is at least conserved. The brown throated three toes sloth. Brazil again and the least conserved. Woo, that is actually good, a breath of relief. The Leonis two toes sloth. That one, I think it's the cutest, if I can be honest. It's the least concern too, and we have here in Brazil. The Huffman's two toes sloth. A least concern again, thankfully, and here in Brazil. As you can see, Brazil is a very good place to find sloths, and they are very, very cute. They are furry as bears, they have big claws just like bears, and they used to be huge, just like bears. That's all I have to say for you today. Thank you for watching. And I hope now you guys can understand why sloths would be an amazing bear. Thank you very much, little bears. And let's take care of the sloths and the bears.